Hey guys, I'm Jagger Weatherby from Wet Paint Entertainment, and I'm here to talk about one gorgeous group that just can't seem to stay out of the press, the fame-loving Kardashian clan. How is it that this loudmouth family has held the public's attention for, like, forever? It's all PR, baby. Buckle your bejeweled seatbelts as the K-dashes show the rest of us little people how it's done. First off, if there's one surefire way to get your name in the news, it's by hooking up with an A-lister. Or 10. Two Kardashian sisters in particular, Kim and Khloe, have been under fire for their relationship choices. Let's tackle Kim first, who was reportedly tied to womanizer John Mayer back in October 2010, right after being linked to One Tree Hill's Michael Copon. All of this from the girl who made a promise not to date for a year. Oh, and then there's Chris Humphreys, though we sincerely hope he didn't put a $2 million ring on it just for show. Yep, keeping up with Kim's love life is almost as hard as keeping up with the Kardashians. Another relationship folks have speculated is all for show is the beautiful union between Chloe and Lamar. We know, we know, after watching an entire season of The Too Cute Couple, we find this hard to believe too, but they did get married after only one month of dating and televised their nuptials. Can't say that about every celebrity couple now, can we? But while we haven't seen Chloe and Lamar's marriage certificate, we've seen just about everything else, and we're calling this one legit. Then there's Kim's infamous airport incident back in 2007. Miss Kim claimed that someone stole over $50,000 worth of goods from her bag at JFK. Apparently the news didn't fly, get it, with the authorities who wrote it off as just another crazy publicity stunt. Next up is Kim's tearful reaction to her very risque nude pictures in W Magazine. Kim got her first look at the pics in an episode of Courtney and Kim Take New York, and she bawled her eyes out because the mag had told her they'd cover up her naughty bits with art and other objects. We don't know if Kim was behind this one or not, but we do remember Momager Chris telling Kim at least the pictures look good, and the fact that it was all caught on camera couldn't be more perfect. Finally, here's a nod to Courtney and Scott. People once claimed that little Mason was a stunt. Let us just say squeezing out a big old baby is quite the sacrifice for fame. Well, there you have it. The world may never know the truth about the potential publicity plays, but you can bet we'll keep watching and reading about them anyway, which is exactly what they want. For more 411 on your fave celebutons, check us out at wetpaint.com slash Courtney and Kim Take New York.